Hello everybody. Today I wanted to discuss about resistor and types of resistor. A resistor is a component designed to have a certain amount of resistance and used to oppose or limit the electric current. When a current of 1 ampere passes through a resistor with a 1 volt drop across its terminals. The current is proportional to the voltage across the terminal ends. This ratio is represented by Ohm's law, R equals V slash I. Resistance of a resistor depends on their length, L, resistivity, rho, and its cross-sectional area, A, which is also known as laws of resistance, R equals rho, L slash A. Resistors are classified into two types, first one is linear resistors, those resistors, which values change with the applied voltage and temperature, are called linear resistors. In other words, a resistor, which current value is directly proportional to the applied voltage is known as linear resistors. Second one is nonlinear resistors. We know that, nonlinear resistors are those resistors, where the current flowing through it does not change according to Ohm's law but, changes with change in temperature or applied voltage. Now in this video we will discuss about linear resistors. In linear resistors there are again two types they are fixed resistors and variable resistors. Fixed resistors, fixed resistor is a resistor which has a specific value and we can't change the value of fixed resistors. Types of fixed resistors Carbon composition resistors A typical fixed resistor is made from the mixture of granulated or powdered carbon or graphite, insulation filler, or a resin binder. The ratio of the insulation material determines the actual resistance of the resistor. The insulating powder, binder, made in the shape of rods and there are two metal caps on the both ends of the rod. There are two conductor wires on the both ends of the resistor for easy connectivity in the circuit via soldering. A plastic code covers the rods with different color codes, printed, which denote the resistance value. Wire wound resistors Wire wound resistor is made from the insulating core or rod by wrapping around a resistive wire. The resistance wire is generally tungsten, manganin, nichrome, or nickel or nickel chromium alloy and the insulating core is made of porcelain, bakelite, press bond paper or ceramic clay material. Thin film resistors Thin film resistors are made of from high grid ceramic rod and a resistive material. A very thin conducting material layer overlaid on insulating rod, plate, or tube which is made from high quality ceramic material or glass. Thick film resistors, the production method of thick film resistors is same like thin film resistors, but the difference is that there is a thick film instead of a thin film or layer of resistive material around. That's why it is called thick film resistors. Variable resistors, as the name indicates, those resistors which values can be changed through a dial, knob, and screw or manually by a proper method. In these types of resistors, there is a sliding arm, which is connected to the shaft and the value of resistance can be changed by rotating the arm. Types of variable resistors, potentiometers, potentiometer is a three terminal device which is used for controlling the level of voltage in the circuit. Rheostats, 
Rheostats are a two or three terminal device which is used for the current limiting purpose by hand or manual operation. Trimmers, there is an additional screw with potentiometer or variable resistors for better efficiency and operation and they are known as trimmers. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more videos.